Long time no. Okay. I deserve that. Look, I know I'm probably the last person you want to see right now. But I just had to come here. And I know you have no reason to hear me out. But please, just give me five minutes. Thank you. Um, can I come in or... N no? Okay. I'll just stand right here then. Okay, so... Um... Well, you were right. You know about her. She really was just using me and cheating on me, too. How did I find out? Well, my parents found out about all the money I was spending on her. And, well, they cut me off. And the moment I told her, she dumped me right then and there. And to pour salt on the wound, she told me flat out that she really was dating another guy for most of our relationship. So, I wanted to apologize for what I said a few months ago, for not believing you, and for, well, Everything, basically. <laughs> yeah. I am glad I came to my senses, too. And, uh, now that I've apologized and everything, I was kind of hoping you could maybe help me with something. What? No, I didn't come here just because I wanted something. Well, okay, I did, but... No, no. Please don't close the door again. Okay, yes, I'm here because I need your help. But I'm also here because I really did want to apologize. I realize now how much I fucked up. And I don't just mean with my parents or with school. I mean with everything, okay? I just... When I started going out with her, I was suddenly so popular with everyone at school. And I thought everything would just stay the same between us. But... Well... Yeah... It all fell apart. Not just with you, but with all our friends. I acted so horribly towards them. Especially towards you. All the pranks and the name calling. And the worst part is, as much as I want to blame her for all of it, I know I can't. It's not like I did anything to help or stop it either. I just kept going until it was too late. I tried patching things up with them too, you know, all our old friends. Yeah, they're all still at our, my school. But you're actually the first to even let me speak. And the one who didn't threaten to hit me if I didn't go away. Actually, one of them really did punch me in the stomach. I still have the bruise to prove it. It was the only way he'd tell me where you and your family moved after you transferred schools. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie. I probably had that punch coming for a while now. And I'll probably have a lot more coming in the future, won't I? 
<laughs> Absolutely. Huh. Yeah. That's probably fair. What did I need help with? Uh, oh, right. It's, uh, it's about my schoolwork. My grades. They're, well, they're not the best. And with that going on top of all the money I've spent, my parents are threatening to kick me out if I don't bring my grades up. Why don't I ask someone at school for help? <laughs> That's kind of hard to do when no one there will even look at me. Turns out, you were right once again. I really did become the biggest jerk on campus. So much so that not even the teachers think they can help me turn my act around. And to top it all off, all of the friends I thought I had when I was dating her practically vanished the moment we broke up. I didn't know where else to go. Everyone at school either hates me or have given up on me. And my parents are so mad at me, they're gonna kick me out even before I graduate. If I can graduate, anyway. I... I'm lost, okay? I have no one else to turn to, and I know what a crappy person I am for asking you to help me, when you probably don't even forgive me. But I'm just so desperate here, I don't know what else to do. I just... I need help. I need my best friend back. Do I remember what I said? You mean a few months ago? Yeah, I do. You want me to repeat? I'll say it. Just don't close the door on me. I'll say it. I said... You were a conniving, jealous freak that, that I regretted seeing as a friend. Did I mean it? No, of course not. I wish more than anything I could go back and take those words back. Do I regret it? Yes, absolutely. I regret everything I did. I regret dating her. I regret bullying you and the others, and I regret making you leave. No, that's probably not enough, is it? As much as I regret it, what happened, happened, and I can't take it back. I can never take it back. I'm sorry. This was a mistake. No, not apologizing, just everything else. I'm sorry for bothering you. Thanks for hearing me out, at least. And again, I'm sorry for everything. I'll just get going now. Hey, why are you grabbing me? What, you gonna punch me in the face too? Wh what? You help me? R really? Then, do you forgive me? N not yet? N yeah, that's fair. But, I have a chance, then? <laughs> a small one, huh? 
Well, I'll take what I can get. Thank you. Thank you so much. And I promise I won't be an asshole again. I'm better, huh? I'm glad to see you're still as feisty as ever. <laughs> you have my word. No more mistakes. And I really do hope you'll be able to see me as a friend again. Sometime in the future. <laughs>